The news in you, north, east, west, south, unite from every alley in Cali, intersection and back street. Yeah, family, in today's news, Patrick Warren Sr. was gunned down by police officers while coming to his home for a mental call. They came to his home because his family called because he was having mental issues. And need I mind you, they came out prior to that the day before, they brought a, a mental specialist that deal with mentals and also the officer. And they just took Warren away and they let him come back home. But on this particular day, uh, just an officer came. And when the officer came, that's when Patrick Warren ended up coming to his demise, which is a sad story. As you can see in the video that I'm going to show you, Really, he was just flailing his arms in the air. And according to his son, he was saying something dealing with faith. Like faith is faith is the way. And so they tased him first. And after they tased him, he got off the ground. And then the officer proceeded to shoot him three times, killing Patrick Warren. Before that even occurred, his son was already telling the officer, don't use no weapons. Basically, let him know my father is not a threat. But what did the officer do? He did what, what they've been doing for too long, for far too long. You're just, you're shooting out of fear. Another thing is, you can't send the wrong person to the job. You're not going to send me to fly a spaceship to Mars with no training. You're going to send the person that's trained to do that job. You don't send just a regular officer to a mental case job. He knows nothing about the psychological of a mental person. He doesn't know how to talk them down. He don't know when they're really a threat or not. He's just looking at all people as a threat. And it doesn't make sense. You're not gonna just let me join the police force and just give me a gun in a police car and say, hey, you're an officer. You're not going to do that. So the same should apply with them too. You can't just send them off to the job. They have no training with mental case patients. We see it time and time again. They kill people that are mentally disturbed because they don't know how to handle it. They don't, they don't know the procedures to use. And with that, it, it just doesn't make sense because these cases, they always occur when somebody has a mental state and what happens, they end up getting the short end of the stick. They always end up getting killed or hurt real bad because these officers are not even trained in that field. So family, we got to do a better job as people. As people, you definitely have to do a better job when hiring these jobs. You got to stop all that nepotism. Oh, get my cousin a job here. Get my friend a job here. But if they can't do the job, they shouldn't be on the job. That's just the bottom line. And that was just a case of that, which cost the man his life. And it doesn't make sense. So I, so family, as I was saying, I have both footages, the footage when they killed Patrick Warren and also the footage where the uh, officer and the mental case person came out the day before. So I'll be showing those at the end of the video. And once again, don't forget, don't, do not forget to subscribe to the channel and give it a thumbs up and uh, have a safe, have a safe uh, rest of the 2021. With that, I'm going to say peace. This is the news in you, north, east, west, south, unite from every alley in Cali, intersection and back street.
Get 